Where fire crews are still monitoring a fire that started at an illegal dumping site on Brant Road back here in southeast Austin. This is happening near Onion Creek. That fire sparked back up multiple times since it started on Friday. And now we're taking a closer look at who is in charge of clearing these sites and the risks they can pose if they catch fire. Nabil Ramadna has the story. A site used for illegal dumping. You can just see the, the black smoke for, for miles. Quickly became a place engulfed in flames. Fire was well deep seated off uh, the main road. On Friday, firefighters from multiple departments responded to the fire on Brant Road in southeast Austin. With dumping sites, we just don't know what type of uh, situation we're getting into. Fire Chief Chris Barron with ESD5 says there could be chemicals, tires, or other harmful materials. It poses a huge threat to not only the firefighters, but the public uh, around those fires because it's putting off all sorts of toxins in the air uh, and stuff that we shouldn't be breathing or, or uh, touching. There's a lot of automotive parts. Over in Williamson County, Constable Paul Leal has been pushing to put a stop to these illegal sites. Just from January the 1st, uh, to now, we've had 486. No fires so far at these dumping sites, but Leal knows the dangers. So many of our dump sites are at low water crossing uh, bridges, and, you know, it, they seem to be the perfect place for people to throw cigarette buds out. Many of these sites contain piles of trash in places that are not easily accessible. And with dry conditions, that means these fires could spread fast. When we get out on these fires, it just the fire takes off. Nabil Ramadna, KXAN News. And the city of Austin says it spends $250,000 a year cleaning illegal dump sites. The code department handles issues within city limits. You can report those by calling 311. Travis County handles areas outside of that. We have a tip line for you at KXAN.com.